DeFi means decentralized finance. And let's just talk about what you can do with it because you know that will make everything clear. With a bank, you can deposit money and it will give you interest. Or you can give them some collateral and they will lend you money. That's like the core nuts and bolts business of a bank. DeFi is doing those two functions and more on a blockchain. So today, if you have just dollars, pounds, euros, how much interest can you get out of that at a bank? Very, I mean, I get no interest on any money I have in my bank. <laughs> yeah. Exactly, yeah, right? If you take those dollars, any currency, and you deposit into a DeFi savings account today, um, you can get 20% interest on flat national currency. Like the key thing here is you're not messing with Bitcoin, Ethereum. You're not making any speculation about prices of those things. This is using fiat currency. So what happens is you, for example, I'm in the U.S. I take you know a thousand dollars U.S. U.S. dollars. Um, I transfer it to to Coinbase. Still a thousand dollars. Coinbase lets me buy this thing called a stable coin, which is a stabilized cryptocurrency pegged to a traditional currency. In this case, a stable coin of U.S. dollars. This, their one preferred one is called USDC. So I take $1,000 and I convert it to 1,000 USDC. Um, still $1,000, no fees has happened. Now, once it's converted to USDC, what is a USDC? A USDC is a token on top of the Ethereum blockchain. It's an ERC-20 token. Um, the crypto protocols are uh, now basically will take my USDC and offer interest rates on deposits of this money. So I can take the $1,000 in USDC, deposit in something like a Compound or Aave or you know, Yearn. These are all like, like online uh, blockchain-based banks, if you will. And today's rate is like anywhere between 7 to 20%. Um, so call it 10%, just, just to be wow. lazy. Right? Uh, you can get 10% on top of just plain cash. Like, that's crazy. <laughs> That is crazy. <laughs> that like is you, crazy. Did require, you did not require Bitcoin to go up. You did not require Ethereum to go up. You did not have to speculate on ICO. It's just, you know, straight cash into equivalent stablecoin deposited away. Now, what's what's different about this versus like a term deposit? A, there is no term. So it's a complete like you can take it in, take it out anytime you would like. B, it's variable interest rate. Right now it's 10 percent, call it. At some point it was very low. It was like one percent. Um, at some point, it's 20%. So it's not a fixed APR um, uh, term deposit. And C, of course, the risk profile is completely different, much higher. Um, this is like most deposit accounts are federally insured. So, you know, a uh, bunch of gangsters go to the bank, steal all your money. You're not going to lose all your money. Um, so it has very high security uh, standards. If the bank fucks up, it's it's still going to, you know, give make sure your money is, is yours. Uh, if you deposit stable coins into a um, into a smart contract and for whatever reason it gets evaporated you know some hacker there's code bugs any reason that that it, it, things go south it's gone it's not uh, there's no number to call there's no insurance agency there are actually insurance agencies but they're none of them are good. Um, but your your the, the risk profile is significantly higher. So I was joking on Twitter. It's like these online um, crypto lending protocols. If you were to rate them as bonds, you know A, B, uh, junk. Like where would you even rate them as bonds? And uh, you know I got all kinds of different answers. But generally, you should consider this as asset you may completely lose. But once again, crypto yeah. is putting something on the menu. Previously, even if you were risky in temperament, you had no way of getting more returns on your savings. But today, if you're risk pro risk in temperament, you can take your thousand dollars, turn it to stable coins, deposit it on the online protocol, and um, you know if things go normal well, then you earn ten percent, twenty percent. Like you can do that today. 